Raining? Yeah. And thundering just a little bit. Wouldn't really want to be boating right now because then you'd have to do a lot of bailing. Good time to not be boating. Uh -huh. Everything in the little canoeing sequence was recorded with the Ambio Smart Headset. So first of all, what is the Ambio Smart Headset? It is a binaural recording microphone, which means that you have microphones that sit in each of your ears and capture sound very much like we hear it. That is to say that if you have something off to the right, yeah, the right microphone is going to pick that up and kind of represent it as if you were hearing something off to the right. And likewise, the left microphone will also pick it up, but it will generally pick up reflections off the wall and it will, re and it will pick it up at a, at a lower level because it's on the other side of your head. Your head is acting essentially as a damping <laughs> device. And so you're getting all of the normal phase relationships that we get when we listen in everyday life. With the Ambio Smart Headset, you're getting sound that sounds very much like everyday life. And it also allows us to kind of hear which direction it's coming from, if it's behind us, um, if it's above us and things of that nature. So it makes for a much more immersive and rich sort of sound recording. Of course, you can use these like regular earbuds with your iPhone. It does have a lightning connector. So this one is for iPhone and iPad. They're working on a version also for Android phones. This means that you can use it just like you would to listen to movies or listen to music or take phone calls and things of that nature. The hooks that fit over your ears to secure the earbuds to your ears and in your ears are a pliable sort of rubberized plastic. They seem very durable. The cabling seems very durable as well. And of course, there's a lightning connector at the end of the approximately one meter cable. The inline controller has a variety of controls, including increase and decrease volume, start and stop, and also a switch that allows you to slide it into binaural recording mode or back to regular earbud mode. Importantly, this also includes three different sizes of domes. These are the little rubber things that fit on the earbuds themselves to make a kind of customized fit for your ears. That's really important, not just from a comfort standpoint, but also if you get the right size, you'll get much better bass response when you are listening back. So that was a nice feature as well that you don't see with a lot of other earbuds. I liked that when you were recording, you could also very much hear your surroundings still, and you could kind of fine tune that. That's a really nice feature because it, not only is it a safety feature, you need to be able to hear what's going on around you if you're recording, especially if you're near a, you know, a road or a street where there are cars or other things, but also from the standpoint that it also helped you to kind of still be in the moment. You could still figure out where you wanted to go and what you wanted to record without taking them out of your ears. The Ambio Smart Headset uses Apogee's pure digital technology. This is really, really great. Now, if you're not familiar with Apogee, Apogee makes some really top tier professional audio gear for studios and things of that nature. But here, what they've done is they have created the analog to digital converters and the digital to analog converters. They've also created a soft limit feature and the preamplifiers for the microphones. Now, if all that's a jumble to you and you have no idea what I'm talking about, that's okay. The bottom line is that you're getting really great audio quality in this set of binaural microphones and headset. I really like the soft limit feature because what that means is that I didn't run into any situations where the sound was so loud that it started clipping and distorting like you often experience with other microphones. Now, one nice feature about this is that when you are recording with your iPhone, it will work with any video recording app that you're using or any audio recording app that you're using. So what that means in practical terms is you're not gonna have to worry about syncing the audio back up to the video in post. It's already there with the video clips. So that's a really nice feature. However, if you do wanna record it separately and perhaps use a larger camera with a bigger sensor, you can do that by just recording to an audio app here and then syncing it to your camera's footage in post. So it becomes a pretty serious filmmaking tool at that point. 
So there's an overall look at the Ambio Smart Headset from Sennheiser. The version for iPhone and iPad is coming soon, and it will follow at some point, Sennheiser says, with the version for Android. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave those down below. And if you have not already subscribed, make sure you do that, and we'll be sure to get you more great videos on how to improve your lighting and sound for video. Talk to you soon. Mm -hmm.